I see it now. The hammy acting. The stench of rotting failure. I know what you are. Then say it out loud. Adam Sandler Vampire. Oh, come on, are you serious? Is it that obvious? Kinda. I mean, it's just your normal voice, but with a bad Romanian accent. You're kidding me, I spent weeks on this accent. Still sucks. Are you frightened? Honestly, yes. Oh, come on, why are you frightened? I'm not that scary. No, it's just, I, I just can't get over Jack and Jill. How can you make something so horrible? Oh, like your one to talk. I can't stay here. I'm gonna go jump off this cliff and hope some sexy, shirtless werewolf rescues me. Uh... This is how I'm represented. Unbelievable. <laughs> Rosie, blah, blah, blah. I do not say blah, blah, blah. Thanks a lot, Dracula. You've succeeded in ruining this entire intro. Bite me. Anyway, happy October, everybody. Now that the movie dry spell is over, let's start off this spooky month with something truly terrifying. An Adam Sandler movie. <laughs> but the freaky part about it is that this movie isn't bad. <gasps> Yeah, I know! Shocking, right? The movie I'm going to review is Hotel Transylvania 2. Now before I get talking about the sequel, let me tell you my thoughts on the first movie. I, I like it. It's not the best movie by any means, especially with Adam Sandler's involvement, but, you know, it's definitely something worth watching once. I mean, the humor's pretty good. Sort of. And the idea alone of all these monsters just getting along in a hotel and going about their everyday lives is pretty cool. But my number one reason for liking this movie is the same reason people actually like Avatar. The movie is visually pleasing. The animation in both of these movies is just beautiful. It is so vivid, so fast, so clear, and it's all thanks to master animator Denny Tartakovsky, who you may know who animated Dexter's Lab and Samurai Jack. But the first Hotel Transylvania, it was fun, it was enjoyable, it was a good kids movie. But let's see how the sequel holds up. The sequel is about Mavis, Dracula's daughter, and Johnny, Dracula's daughter's husband, now having a child of their own. And Dracula is wondering whether or not this child would be a human or a vampire. Okay, let's get started on the points. For starters, I love how in this movie, the monster world has become so PC. Like, even more so than the first movie. I especially love how PC everything is and how much it pisses Dracula off. That really got me laughing. Once again, the animation is beautiful. It is, I think it's even a little better than, than the first movie. All the characters you love are back. Frankenstein, Wolfman, CeeLo Green Mummy. Wait, that's not CeeLo Green. Oh, it's Key from Key and Peel. Okay, that's fine then. And honestly, I know this is a little unfair, but this movie automatically gets 10 points for having Mel Brooks in it. And I gotta warn you, Mel Brooks is only in a small portion of the movie, but it's just worth it to hear him in his vampire accent. It's actually pretty hysterical. So, what's my final verdict about this movie? Well, it's good, don't get me wrong, it's just... I don't know, it's... It could be a little better, but then again, that was the same verdict for the first movie. But as is, it's pretty fun to watch. I mean, like I said, the animation is great. The voice acting is great. And the story, well, I gotta admit, the story in this one is not as good as the first one, but oh well. I mean, if you have kids of your own, they, they will love this movie. If you saw the first one and liked it, you'll probably like this movie. But if you're a moviegoer who is just curious to see what this movie is all about, 
I would wait until it comes out on DVD, or at least an online release. So, here's my final score. Count Roshi gives this movie a 7 out of 10. Thank you so much for watching my review. Now, if you'll excuse me, that Belichick told me I find out what movie I'm reviewing next at the bottom of that cliff. Huh. Why would a movie that I need to review next be down here? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa, hey, 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 what's going on here? <laughs> fly, Roshi. Just think warm and happy thoughts and fly. Oh, no. Not another Peter Pan movie. Next time. Yeah.